Mwancho mwaligiri uwe channel yetu ya Nka TV Ne mambia igatu wa achiri baka seki nyoreki ya gya Gionseli Village A uh, sub county ya Gionseli uh, Yego toka semasige West Ward A uh, e, e constituency ya Bobasi Bobasi constituency Arabi sana aga igase nitu wa achiri igase mambia igatu wa tevirigu wa mangana yogo kumia E sanduki ya nyoruga ige sanduki ya korokana nenke iyo mwana E buwate akanyamaga keime iga Tikatona nyoroba nyaki nyoroga iga babiru batu tupara Tutevi nki kia baga iga e mambia iga ya bon iga Tukwate iga mungwana yomo Ala chiko tuwerera Nki arora na ama arora ena arali Uwete la se ege nti kiki apendiri iga iga Ase kinyoreki iga gya gionsa Karibu sana Hey my name is Musa Jafet I come from this area Sita ongea kiki si because Ah I want to represent the rest of the guys who come from Gionseri on what I've seen. And this morning uh, we got information on even social media that the, there was a COVID that was lying in one of uh, a nearby river. I went there personally. I saw the COVID. Uh, it's brown in color, covered with a velvet. No, a, a, leather, a leather clothing. And inside the coven, there was a pit of a piece of uh, curried meat. And uh, beside or around the near surrounding, there was also some piece of meat that was wrapped in a newspaper. And uh, just by sight, there was also a tenable beba bag that is normally put to, to carry whatever that we want to go and shop. Personally, I took pictures. I went around the coven. I don't want to con make conclusions, but um, even when people want to get information, they do forensic analysis. They interpret the scene and whatever they, they see. All right. Uh, when you looked at the meat, uh, the kind of meat you said you saw in the coven, uh, do you think it's uh, human meat or just any animal meat? I cannot be able to confirm that because I haven't seen a uh, human meat before. But I sh what I saw is was just um, a boneless uh, flesh. But um, I'm still asking myself these questions. Huh? Why is it that uh, the flesh that was just nearby wrapped with a newspaper? And what was the meaning of the bag that was just nearby? Secondly, I want to ask myself a question that I've yet not answered myself. Why? If it was human meat, or if it was a consumption of human, a human being body, why is it that some, some part that is of human, feasible human part, body was not, was not seen or was not noticed? Why is it that we couldn't be able to get a finger of a human being, the skin of a human being, or anything that we can relate to human flesh or human body? I'm still asking myself that question. I'm All right. All right. Uh, as you have seen, a lot of people have come around. Uh, what is your thinking about the, the incident and what can you tell Kenyans about this? Well, I'm Kenyan, I'm Kisi, I come from this region. I've traveled so many parts of the country. Some parts of the country are very timid and, um, and, um, and remote. People can make different conclusions, people can uh, make different judgments. But when you analyze from the erect guys, guys who understand things, guys who try to understand, uh, to enumerate and uh, analyze issues, uh, this is an issue that is connected to some, maybe some issues to do with enmity, or that want to as aspire some information, but it's, there's nothing to do with uh, witchcraft on this issue. There's nothing to do with human consumption, uh, meat consumption here, because um, of the facts that I can be able to tell. I don't, I don't understand how human meat can be loved in a, a newspaper. All right, all right. And, uh, you know, of late, there's been uh, a lot of uh, news concerning Kisi and witchcraft. You know, and when we talk about uh, a coffin, it's a sign of uh, witchcraft, yeah? Yeah, it's a sign of uh, dead people. So wh what you can talk about it? Uh, once more, if I repeat that, when we do issues to do with... Um, Forensics, so when we want to get information, people can give wrong information or can tamper with information to give a cover-up. Huh? 
uh, you know, the incidents that are occurred in uh, wherever uh, the other parts of the country, especially in Kisis, have they have always been analyzed in several ways in on social media. And uh, maybe this is connected to what 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 happened the other side of Kisi land. And as well, I hope the TCI because they have taken the coven, they have taken whatever the fresh that was there. I hope they are going to do their analysis to be able to tell whether this is human fresh or whether it's animal fresh. And I believe as well they are going to do dusting with the, the coffin and whatever that they, they, they took to be able to tell whether this, how, how they, whatever the information that they are going to give on how these are live deer, if maybe they can be able to charge and be able to tell who were the people who are handling this coffin. And most importantly, I believe the, the fortunate guys and the guys from DCI are going to analyze this specimen, the, the fresh that was there, most importantly, to analyze and be able to tell us whether it's human fresh or if it's, it's animal fresh. If they give information on this, and I believe the, the media is going to be dispensed this information, whether the report they get is human fresh or it's animal fresh, so that we can be able to, you, we, as a, we as the mass, we can be able to, to be given information that it was f human fresh or animal fresh, so that at the end of the day, it's quick kwamba, maybe ni wikisis to naribiwa jina without evidence.